Hey Rick, this is Paul here. I got your bike here up on the lift and this video is for you. Um, you'll have read the sort of portion of this in the uh, text message that I sent you, but I wanted to show you this video. So these are uh, fork leg, I'm going to call them uh, sexy girl leggings. Sometimes uh, you'll see these on front fork legs, they're called gaiters, and it's like a rubber waffle that kind of goes up and protects the very sort of uh, soft metal that's underneath there from being scratched up from going through the dirt, all this rocks and debris would hit this. So people put either gaiters or these sexy girl leggings on them, lady of the night leggings <laughs> on them to protect this metal from uh, from being damaged. Um, I can feel though, at least it's certainly what it feels like to me. I may be wrong, but it feels to me like underneath these uh, sexy girl leggings, uh, there's no dust cover. And if there's no dust cover, then I'm not a fan of these uh, leggings because when moisture, water, gets on this, it stays soaked like a, uh, like a sponge or, you know, a cloth would. And that moisture is a great place for dirt to stick to and make its way into the very sensitive fork seals that are underneath here. I'm pretty confident that these fork seals are not leaking, for if they were, the oil that comes out of the fork leg would soak this leg or would soak the legging and you'd be able to tell. It'd be like, oh, you can clearly see that something's not right because the oil is coming out. But I just want to cut these clips off on video and show you uh, underneath them uh, about my suspicion of the absence of a dust cover, which in my opinion is possibly one of the most important parts of how fork seals go together. So let's cut this off. Okay, and then slide up your sexy girl legs here. Okay, so I was wrong which is great, I love being wrong when it's like this. So there is a dust cover in there. Am I right about that? That's a fairly unique looking dust cover. I've not seen one that looks like that before. But um, dry and looking good. Um, still, I'm not a fan of this because like I said, moisture gets underneath here and this, this thing stays wet. And I think it will just sort of make matters kind of worse here. Uh, in my opinion, I would remove these and um, and either put on shields, on the plastic shields that go on the front like this. Um, I definitely wouldn't go with gators because gators also trap the water in there. But, um, but okay, yeah, never mind this video. <laughs>